Hi friends, we come across Hanuman temple in every corner and nook of the streets. So how great Hanuman is? He actually he belonged to Treta Yuga, but still from Treta Yuga still he is there, and he is that is why he is called Chiranjeevi. He did not have death, and Hanuman's role is very well played in Ramayana and especially in one kanda called Sundara Kanda. In that Sundara Kanda. hanuman's presence of mind his achievements his communication skills and everything his great power in enhancing his body and reducing his body and every aspect is well defined well explained in sundara kanda that is why this is called sundara kanda actually what is meant by sundara sundara means beautiful amongst all kandas in ramayana sundara kanda plays very vital role in what way is it important we know hanuman is a great devotee of rama wherever rama as stories are narrated wherever rama's name is chanted there hanuman's presence will be there that is why we have one shloka yatra yatra raghunath kirtanam tatra tatra krutamastha kanjali bhashpavari paripurna lochanam mahartim namta rakshasa santakam that means wherever rama's name is chanted there we find hanuman of course we can't see him with our naked eyes in any form he will be there that is his association with rama that is his devotion to rama so let us go into the details of sundara kanda it was decided that hanuma is the only person who could cross the sea crossing it is not a small one he had to cross 100 yojanas to reach lanka so he was the only one who could cross the sea then hanuman stood at the foot of mahendra mountain then he prayed sun god his father vaidev brahma and all other gods then he raised his body to the maximum height climbed on to the top of the mountain took a long breath and then jumped into the air just like the arrow of rama then started his flight indra asked mainaka to come on to the surface of the sea mainaka was none other than another mountain so that whenever he floats on the sea hanuma could take rest for a while so indra ordered mainaka to come and float on the sea even even the sea god felt happy seeing mainaka hanuma said to mainaka angrily why are you standing as an obstacle on my way i am going in search of sita for that mainaka said you please stay for a while on me you have to cross 100 yojanas it's not a small distance please take rest for a while for that hanuma said no i don't want to take any rest until i find sita mata said and he continued his flight devatas wanted to test power of hanuma so they sent a nagin naga devata to go and test his power so as surasa a demon stood in front of hanuma and it was about to swallow hanuma it opened its mouth then hanuma said who are you why are you standing on my way you please move away from me for that surasa said no i am going to swallow you for that hanuma when she said so hanuma raised his body when he raised his body even sursa extended and expanded its mouth the more he expanded his body the more sursa expanded its mouth then hanuma reached the height of 90 yojanas then sursa raised its mouth to 100 yojanas then hanuma applied his presence of mind then reduced his body to the size of a finger and then entered into its mouth 
and came out of its ears sarasa appreciated his presence of mind got her original poem and blessed him then hanuma again continued his journey through the sea another nemman named simhini stood in front of hanuma and objected his flight it opened its mouth and said i am very hungry i will swallow you saying so it opened its mouth hanuma without saying a word entered into its body then raised his body to maximum height at that in that way he pierced from its stomach and he came out of the stomach of simhini hanuma further continued his journey and then he found at a distance he found something like a beautiful island with beautiful palaces he thought definitely it might be lanka the residence of ravana perhaps sita mata must be there so very happily he flew and was about to land on the island named lanka all the demons of lanka are being protected by a dai adhisthana devata named lankani so lankani stood in front of hanuma and objected how dare you to enter into our kingdom this is the kingdom of demons who are you to enter into our kingdom for that hanuma said i just was fascinated by seeing the surroundings of this lanka there are many beautiful palaces i will take a uh, look at all these beautiful surroundings and then go back what's wrong with you let me go and have a look at all these as